call what everyone lives there. I had a good uncle. I had a good uncle out Simon Doherty. Good box. A box. A box is so good. Old Blondie, Blondie Simon. Good box. Hilly's name is an old. Old Blondie Simon. Camping, so he was camp in Manchester. He was in Dutchy Road. They put him on a Dutchy Road. He's in, he's in uh, Stoke and Trent. He bet all the London Doherty's. He bet them all in his young day, right? And now we're doing he bet Bob Gastic. Now we're doing it. He's my first cousin. I had two uncles, Thomas and Barney, was never bet. Plus, my father was never bet. We camp and fight and breed. But the Birmingham Doherty's and the London Doherty's didn't come and fight and breed of people. They're nobodies. They talk like women. And now they're trying to gang up to have gang fights. They're trying to gang up to have the gang, crowd. gang fights is no good, right? We all we want is a clean fight. When the, when we have a clean fight, we're meeting a hundred people every time but four men goes. But they don't know and then they're telling us we'll have a clean fight, would she? They ha they're having no clean fights. They just want to gang us up. Now before we go, I want the world to watch us on YouTube. Between settled people, travelling men, gypsy men, all over the whole world, Ireland, England, America, the, the men that's getting on YouTube, like the Navy, and them Gomes and Longford, the Marine Navy fellas, Joe Jice's family, the Ned Mongin, uh, Stokes, the wee small punks, little leprechaun men, they're not fighting men, they have no proof, they have no DVDs, they have nothing, they have any phone calls, they have nothing. I have every proof in the world where I bet the world. I am the greatest man, I'm not a sick man now. I took my title back in Galway. I had to go to Galway after four years and get my title back. So these men, please, don't even make a laugh, these wee men. Don't get excited. These is not fighting men. And there's nobody on the phone to these men. They're the mock phone calls to their ears. So, Punk, do me a favour, I beg of you. Before I give them brain damage to them, just round them, would you? Because that's what I do with them. End of the story. We are number one. What I did, the foul jaws. I broke all days. I have no... That's where I ended up at Galway. What? There, that's not a hundred stitches. All my teeth is there. Every one of them. There's my lips, and there's my jaws, they're not broke. The king, man, the fucking king, greatest man in the world, in the fucking world, man, the class man, the class man. I am the king, number one, and me sons are the kings. This is the chap of the world, greatest man in the fucking world, man. Come on, old Joe, get it on, you sick old, you sh you, uh, Welton, Welton, Zeiss, Joe, old Welton, I, I, I give you brain damage, that's why you've Welton's up your ears. So I get turned to our brain. Joe Joyce, young Joe Joyce, this is the young Simon McGinley speaking here. My name is not Simon, my name is Simon McGinley. And we know you are nobody, Joe Joyce. I promise you said, I know, I'm nobody, you're no. I am someone, I came from the king. You are nobody, you came from a, a workman, a man's called out, Harry Joe Joyce. He was never worked. He wasn't more that sausage man, he was the useless man in the world. I am the young king, I'm like my father, yeah? I said it on the other tape, I said it again. I will promise you, Joe, if you come out in front of me, boy, I will promise you, I will knock you out. I'm no little five foot eight or five foot nine man. I am six foot one, a 16 stone weight, boy. And when you come out in front of me, you will remember young Simon McGindley. And I'll promise you on that, and I'm telling you now, Bring it on, and I said I'm waiting for this day. Now this is a reach and it's coming back to you. I am beating you, Joe, and I am knocking you out. I went to Dublin to fight you. You weren't there. You were on the phone and said, yes, you were coming. I said, that to do, Joe. I said, come to Galway, when Barney took his title back off Paddy Ward. Of Jaws and Paddy. And I said, get there, young Joe Joyce, and you weren't there. And, we, and you're hiding and we, like a little woman, man. And my brother Woolly landed back, which is the best 200 million man in the country as well. When my brother Trevor's bet, young David, the world knows that. We can't deny that. My brother Woolly would stop you, David, in a minute and a half. You wouldn't even fight me, brother. The other fellow you said with the wee moustache. He would knock the head of your body. You're never been out. Uh, McGinley's our name, and fight is our game. Yeah, my brother Please. Woolley fought Joe's Arter, yeah? He fought for 13 minutes. He bet Joe's Arter. At, at the end of the fight, what did he say? I will fight anyone who's bred for my mother. Bring them out of it. You never came back in a reach, Hannes. My brother Barney bet the whole country, and I am betting the whole country. Joe, come out to me, and I'll show you what I'm going to do to you, Joe. What, my father's only six foot in height, and he knocked your father seven days a week out, left and a right. I am not shouting, I'm not roaring. I promise you, if you come out in front of me, I am giving it to you, boy. Come bet, to me and try me. Bet you, George Eyes, five times. Put you asleep, you can't have good sons. This is the king. You never was the king. In England, there is all good gypsy men. I got a son-in-law. I got a son-in-law, world's pro, heavyweight, super heavyweight champion of the world. And that ties that Lewis, all the Lewis Welch, good boxers, all gypsy men are good men to fight, and everyone a fair play to them. And that Tyson Fury, 
that man fought for he's fighting for the whole world for us all for everyone the more than my boys fighting for all hosts yeah. and I fought for Joe, all them Joe Look, Young Joe they Joe. are all fighting men Joe Joyce them the hardies running them the hardies running the gypsy men down in this country that they could not fight little leprechauns Irish leprechauns follow me up with that camera for a minute please this is the hardies I've got the two of them here along. Yeah, yeah but this this listen this, this, this is the king now that's the cheers this, this is oh this is my this is my chair I'm the king this is Francie the bitch's chair. It's Francie the bitch. There he is. There's the bus. And this, this is the butt. This is the <laughs> butt's chair here. You're yeah, yeah, bound we by you. Huh? You're awful, I swear to God. This is, this is, this is Kill with the bitch and the, uh, what is it? Francie. Francie, the butt and Kill with the bitch. Lodge, your This bread. is my chair. Listen, wait a minute. I'm taking, my, I'm taking their chairs. I'm taking their chairs off the ground and I'm putting them into my chairs. <laughs> Make one fine man, maybe. Put the two chairs in there. <laughs> Ask them now. <laughs> now, that's their little chairs. They're in my that. chair. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Hey, no. <laughs> hey, don't mate. Hey, do nothing to do with that. Larry, Larry, down there. Larry Joe, you said you, you'll okay, beat me in the body. You won't touch me in the head. I'll tell you what I'm going to do with you. I am going to show you what a young Siamese met out of. I'm the finest traveling man in the world. Come here and try me. This is only the body. <laughs> Come on, man. Come on, try me. You want to try me out? This is all in the body, man. This is not the head work yet. Come on, try me. Come on, man. Come on, Come on, man. This is Joe. This is his job, man. Come on, man. Get it in, man. Lay on it. Push, push. Come on. Step on it. Step on it. Lay on it, man. Come on, come on, come on. Push in your hands harder. Get him. Drive the men right now. Come on. Get up on Joe, man. Come on. Will you drive the men to me? I love it. I love it. I love this, it. Is for, this is for young George Eyes. And this is not going for young George. This is going for every traveling man in the country. Dorothy's everyone. I will fight them. Bring them to me, and I'll show you, Joe, what a Simon McGinley is made out of. Oh, Chris, here now, you. please, lads, the world is watching this. I beg of you, stop making your DVDs. Stop your fool act and tell the people you're fighting us when you won't box us. Please, I beg you, for God of love. No, get the out whole with world stop. knows get we up. will fight. Listen. This is not talk. Quinch, we will fight. Quit all this with G. Jaisis. And authorities, you're nobody's. Now, that's the end of it. Don't be roaring and shouting. Now, power shots. Now, from big men, power up back. Now, Joe Giles, this is a man from six foot five in height, yeah? Look at now, work power now, yeah? Go. Now, we are bread for men. Please, I'm begging of you, stop your fool act with your DVDs. We're here at the box, not fool act. Yes, now, we are up. the kings. And now, I don't want no more tears, made, Jaisis. We've seen enough of you. We you, crucified you, hey. or the punks, fellas, or any travellers. Get off from us, and if you want to come to fight, come and try us. Take Wellington's, George Jais. I brain damaged him. He's all wetless now. Should be on his feet. On his feet. He put them on his hands. I brain damaged him. He doesn't know if you're wearing his weapons on his feet or is he wearing them on his hands. Put him into the old folks' home. <laughs> Joseph Mann is 5 foot 11 in height. And look at George Eyes between me and him. I'm no 5 foot 8. Put it in the brain. You're listening, too many, you're listening to too many rumours. I am young. Don't call me Simon. I came from me. I, I'm called after my uncle Simon. was the best travelling man in the world. And it's his brother. Don't call me Simon. I am Simon McGindley. And that's it. And go and kiss the McGindleys, Annie McGindley's fucking arse.